Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we will see an easy tutorial to, in which we will see how to um, extend a curve uh, in, uh, is, uh, uh, in a direction that is tangent to the last point of the curve itself. So um, we will do something like this. We have a curve and we will have a slider we let us to extend the curve in the direction of the tangent to the last point. It's a very easy exercise, but uh, it could be useful. If for you it's useful, please uh, like the videos and uh, subscribe to my channel. Let's draw a curve in Rhino and we supposed to uh, we want to uh, extend this curve in the direction of the normal in of, of this curve in this point. So first of all we uh, bring the curve inside Grasshopper so we create a curve parameter so uh, with the right of the mouse a right click on the mouse we select set one curve and we mm, choose our curve now what we are going to do is uh, evaluate evaluate the curve on this point to do this we go we click on the canvas two times and we write evaluate evaluate curve where we want the the curve to be evaluated is uh, we can easily with the right click on the C reparameterize the curve and then uh, we set uh, um, a parametric number here we set 1 and in this way we select the last, the last point if we wanted this point uh, we uh, um, only have to put zero to this parameter, but we want to extend this curve in this in this curve in this direction, direction tangent to the curve, in a tangent direction to the curve. So now we have this point, and now we can move a second point in direction tangent to the previous one to the curve. So we take the previous um, point and we move it in the direction of the tangent. Perfect. Now we have the second point and uh, uh, now uh, we create a line between the, the two points. So the first one that was the end point of the curve and the second one that uh, is the extended point. In this way, we uh, extend the curve in the direction of its tangent. Now, to have only uh, a curve, we can join. We can use join to uh, join the first curve that was into the parameter to the second. Uh, curve that is into line component so the result is a planar curve we can uh, disable preview of all of it of, of uh, this part and so this is our final curve and uh, if we want to to uh, control the amount of uh, the extension in in direction of the tangent uh, at the last point of the curve it is very easy we ins insert a multiplicator here and so we are going to multiplicate the value of the tangent for uh, um, a slider so uh, I use for example 5.6 This way I can control the, 
the extension the length of the uh, extension of the curve in the direction of the tangent 